Erica, well, actress Noelle Desiato, you might not know the name, but you probably know her many faces. Noelle is known to audiences for her versatility of work and chameleon-like ab ability to change characters right before your eyes. Now, she has won accolades for her one-woman show, Tea at Five, which is an intimate look at the late Katharine Hepburn over a more than 40-year period. Now, Noelle Desiato joins us, fortunately for us, to join and talk about the show and the great Kate, of course, a lot of uh, very beloved name in Connecticut. You've been yes. an actress for more than 30 years. Yes. And in the show, you aged 40 years, but we'll get to that in a second. <laughs> yes. uh, what, what draws you to a character like Kate Hepburn? Um, who she is? Yeah. Uh, that's a very good question. I think it's, it's great fun going for, from her younger years to her older years. Um, and she had so much to offer and so much to teach. And, and for people to still take notice of, and that's what I like to get across, and that's a good thing. Quite a character. She, we have a lot of quotes that we still hear or read all the time. Mm -hmm. She was really uh, a well-versed and well-thought woman, th uh, woman, I think. Yes. Um, now, this show, Tea at Five, which is a one-woman show. Yes, it is. Tell us a little bit about it. Well, we opened, we started uh, in 2008 at Theatre Works New Milford. Uh, uh, dear friends, and. Uh, uh, and my wonderful director, Jane Farnell, and uh, Bill Hughes is the one who suggested uh, from Theatre Works that we do it. And um, he said there is a, a, a play written by Matthew Lombardo called T at Five. And so it, it evolved. Um, so I toured uh, different theaters in Connecticut. So, and it was lovely that Sue Evans saw me in um, Southbury just recently. So it's great to get it out there because people do enjoy it. and I. I hope to especially, carry on with it. Especially so. with the local flavor of it, and we understand that it's also the entire thing is set in her Fenwick Estate apartment, or, or her place over in Old Saybrook, and I believe we have a, qu a clip from the show oh. that we can show right now. Okay. And according to theater critics, I certainly couldn't act. <laughs> oh, some of the headlines. You better, better take a lifeboat to the lake. Uh, better to drown than see the lake. <laughs> One of my personal favorites, be like a pebble and just skip the lake. <laughs> but at least I knew my good friend Dorothy Parker would stick by my side. Oh, her headline made history. Go to the Martin Beck Theater and watch Catherine Hepburn run the gamut of emotion from A to be. <laughs> that is something else. You know, I, you do a much better Kate than I do. I got to tell you, about an hour ago, I tried to do a little bit of, um, and I, it was more you like, did. it was more like an impression of the Hindenburg. Well, I, I bet you did a wonderful yeah, job. Didn't do so well. I, I wish I'd seen that. <laughs> well, you're, that is really, that is so impressive. I well, feel like I'm watching and listening to Kate Hep Hepburn. You're a native New Englander. Yes, I am. I'm from Bath, Maine. So, yes, and, and so Bath. there's a little, ba Bath, Maine, <laughs> Bath. okay, yes, yes, to the, with pinky extended. <laughs> All right, now we also have a clip, by the way, uh, of you as the aging Katherine Hepburn. Okay. And this is all just later in the show. Yes. So you do a remarkable transformation. Let's have a look at this. All right. One minute I'm driving along the Saybrook Causeway, and next I'm watching a nurse take her scissors to my Prada slabs. <laughs> Long story short, I hit a telephone pole. Oh, me and Phyllis both bam smack right into it. Well, thank the Lord it was there, or else I would have ended up like my young bridegroom in the lake. <laughs> Can you imagine my funeral? Would have been complete mockery. Oh, calla lilies everywhere. <laughs> All right, now we, we've got to move along and finish up uh, with, you know, how people can get more information. Um, yes. But while we're showing that on our screen, can you just tell us real quickly how you made that transformation? That's just amazing. That's a, that's a long story. I'm not sure. Okay. That's, Maybe that's for another a, day. That's Maybe, another, another hey, story. There's a perfect excuse for you to come on back and tell us more. Yes, we'll maybe that, it's a lot easier doing that than here. <laughs> we'll call that a deep tease. How's that? All right. Clever. All right, and uh, I believe we're going to break now. Yes, it is 7.51. Thank we'll be back much. in just a few moments. Thank you, Noel Desiato. We'd love having you here. It's great. Go to our website for more information. We'll be right back. Thank you.